All glories to Srila A.C. Bhakti Vedanta Swami Prabhupada Ki Jai. All glories to Srila Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami Maharaj Ki Jai. Sri Chaitanya Charitamrita Madhya Leela, Chapter 19, Text 77. Sadane Prabhu Devata Nukate Chadana Vikshadite Nijagare Chalila Lana Balaba Bhattacharya then put Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and his associates aboard a boat and took them to his own place to offer them lunch. Seventy eight Yamunara Jala Deki Chikana Shamala Prema Vesha Mahaprabhu Haila Vibala. While crossing the river Yamuna, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu saw the glossy black water and was immediately bewildered with ecstatic love. Seventy nine. Unkara kari amunara jale di la janta prabhu de ki sabara ane haila vaya kanpa. Indeed, as soon as Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu saw the river Yamuna, he immediately made a great sound and jumped into the water. Everyone was filled with fear and trembling to see this. 80. Aste vyaste sa bedari, prabude utaila, naukara upare prabhu nachite la gila. They all hastily grabbed Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and pulled him out of the water. Once on the boat's platform, the Lord began to dance. 81. Mahaprabhu Rabade Nauka Kareta La Mala Dubi Tela Gila Nauka Jala Ke Bade Jala Due to the Lord's heavy weight, the boat began to tilt. It began filling up with water and was on the verge of sinking. 82 Yajapi Bate Raage Prabhu Ratarya Yajapi bhate ra age, prabhura darya hailamana, dubhara udbata prema nahe sambharana. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu tried to restrain himself as far as possible before Vallabhacharya, but although he tried to keep calm, his ecstatic love could not be checked. 83. Desha patra de ki maha prabhu darya haila adai lera gate nauka asi utarila. Seeing the circumstances, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu finally became calm so that the boat was able to reach the shore of Adaila and land there. 84. Bhaye bata Vajana Karana Nija Gurhe Anila Prabhure Sangete Lana Fearing for the Lord's welfare, Valbacharya stayed in his association. After arranging for his bath, the Bhattacharya took the Lord to his own house. 85 Anandita Hanabata Tila divya sana, apane kari la prabhura para prachalana. When Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu arrived at his home, Vallabha uh, Bhattacharya, being greatly pleased, offered the Lord a nice sitting place and personally washed his feet. 86. Sabam se se ijala, mashtake darila, nutana kopina ba, hirvasa paraila. Valba Bhattacharya and his whole family then sprinkled that water over their heads. They then offered the Lord new underwear and outer garments.
87. Gandha puspa dupadi pe maha puja kaila batacharye manya kari paka karaila. Balabacharya worshipped the Lord with great pomp, offering scents, incense, flowers, and lamps, and with great respect he induced Balabhadra Bhattacharya, the Lord's cook, to cook. 88. Dikshakaraila prabure sashneha yatane rupa goshani dui vaye karaila bojane. Thus Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was offered lunch with great care and affection. The brothers Rupa Goswami and Sri Balaba were also offered food. 89. Bhattacharya Sri Rupe Diyoyayla Vesesha Tadesei Prashada Krishna Dasa Paila Sesha Balabacharya first offered the remnants of the Lord's food to Srila Rupa Goswami and then to Krishna Das. 90. Mukhavasa diya prabhure karaila sayana apane bata karena prabhura parasambhana The Lord was then given spices to purify his mouth. Afterwards he was made to rest and Vallabha Bhattacharya personally massaged his legs. 91. Prabhu Pataila Tandre Karite Bojane Bojana Kari Aila Tenho Prabhu Racharane. While Vallabha Bhattacharya was massaging him, the Lord asked him to go take Prashadam. After taking Prashadam, he returned to the lotus feet of the Lord. 92. Enakale aila ragu pati upadhayaya Tirhu tiruhita pandita bara vaishnava mahashaya At that time Ragupati Upadhayaya of the Tiruhita district arrived. He was a very learned scholar, a great devotee, and a respectable gentleman. Tiruhita or Tiru, uh, this is the purport. Tiruhita or Tiruhitya is a combination of four districts in Bihar Saran, Champaran, Muzaffapur, and Darbanga. The people of this state are called Tiruhitya. 93. Asitenho Kaila Prabhura Charana Vandana. Krishnamati Rahu Bali Prabhura Vachana Ragupati Upadhyaya first offered his respects to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and the Lord gave him his blessings, saying, Always stay in Krishna consciousness. 94. Suniya Nandita Haila Upadhyaya Ramana Prabhu Tanre Kahila Kaha Krishnera Varnana Ragupati uh, Ragupati Upadhyaya was very pleased to hear the Lord's blessings. The Lord then asked him to describe Krishna. Upadhyaya. Nine, uh, 95. Nijakrita Krishna Lila Shloka Padila Suni Maha Prabhura Maha Prema Vishahaila. When Ragupati Upadhyaya was requested to describe Krishna, he began to recite some verses he had personally composed about Krishna's pastimes. Hearing those verses, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was overwhelmed with ecstatic love. 96. Shrutima pari smirtim itare Shrutima pari smirtim itare Varatam anye Vajantu bhavabita 
Aham miha nandam vande yasya linde param brahma. Raghupati Upadhyaya recited, Those who are afraid of material existence worship the Vedic literature. Some worship Smriti, the corollaries to the Vedic literature, and others worship Mahabharata. As far as I am concerned, I worship Krishna's father, Maharaj Nanda, in whose courtyard the Supreme Personality of Godhead, the Absolute Truth, is playing. This verse, recited by Raghupati Upadhyaya, was later included in Sri Rupa Goswami's Padyavali 126. Ninety-seven. When Raghupati Upadhyaya was requested by the Lord, when Raghupati Upadhyaya was requested by the Lord to recite more. He immediately offered his respects to the Lord and granted his request. 98. Kamprati katya itam vise, samprati kova pratitim ayutu, gopatitanaya kunje, gopavadhuti vitam brahma. To whom can I speak? Who will believe me when I say that Krishna, the Supreme Personality of Godhead, is hunting the gopis in the bushes by the banks of the river Yamuna? In this way, the Lord demonstrates his pastimes. 4. This verse was also later included in Padyavali 99. 99. Prabhu kahena kaha teno pade krishna lila prema veshe prabhura deha mana alu yaila Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu requested Raghupati Upadhyaya to continue speaking about the pastimes of Sri Krishna. Thus the Lord was absorbed in ecstatic love and his mind and body slackened. Purport Our minds and bodies are always engaged in material activities. When they are activated on the spiritual platform, they slacken on the material platform. One hundred. Prema deki upadhyayera haila chamatkara vanusya nahe inho krishna karila nirdara. When Raghupati Upadhyaya saw Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's ecstatic symptoms, he decided that the Lord was not a human being, but Krishna himself. 101. Prabhu kahe Upadhyaya stresta mana kaya, shamameva param rupam kahe Upadhyaya. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asked Raghupati, Upadhyaya, according to your decision, who is the foremost being? Purpur. Raghupati Upadhyaya replied, Lord Shamsundara is the supreme form. 102. Shamrupera Vasastana Stvestamana Kaya Puri Madhu Puri Vara Kahe Upadhyaya of all Krishna's abodes, which do you think is best? Purpur. Raghupati Upadhyaya said, Madhu Puri or Mathuradam is certainly the best. Lord Krishna has many forms, as stated in Brahma Samhita 5.33. Advaita Machuti Manadi Manantarubam. <clears throat> Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asked Raghupati Upadhyaya, which form was the best of Lord Krishna's millions of forms? And he immediately replied that the supreme form was the Shamsundara form. In that form, Krishna stands curved in three places and holds his flute. The Shamsundara form is also described in the Brahma Samhita 
विमंजना चोर्चिता बाकी विलोचनेना शांता सदाएँ वृद्धाये शुभालोकायांती यम शाम सुंदरा मचिंचा गोनस्वरूपम गोविंदा मारी पुरुषम तमहम बजामे I worship the primeval Lord Govinda, who is always seen by the devotee whose eyes were anointed with the pulp of love. He is seen in his eternal form of Sham Sundara, situated within the heart of the devotee. Those who are filled with ecstatic love for Krishna always see the form of Sham Sundara within their hearts. Raghupati Upadhyaya confirms the absolute truth. The, uh, the Supreme Personality of Godhead has many incarnations. Narayana, Nirasimha, Varaha, and others. But Krishna is distinguished as the supermost. According to Srimad Bhagavatam 1.3.28, Krishna is to Bhagavan Svayam. Krishna is the original personality of Godhead. Krishna means Shyam Sundara, who plays his flute in Vrindavan. Of all forms, this form is the best of all. Krishna lives sometimes in Mathura and sometimes in Dwarka but Mathura is considered the better place. This is also confirmed by Rupa Goswami in his Upade Samrutta, 9. By Kuntaj Janito Bara Madhupuri. Madhupuri, where Mathura is far superior to the Vaikuntha Lokas in the spiritual world. 103. Baya Pug Baya Puganda Kai Sura Stavista Mana Kaya Baya Kai Sura Kam Deyam Kahe Upadhyaya Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asked the three ages of Krishna, known as childhood, boyhood, and fresh youth. Which do you consider best? Purpur, Raghupati Upadhyaya replied, Fresh youth is the best age. 104. Rasagana madhye tumi srista mana kaya Adhya eva paro rasa kahe upadhyaya when Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asked, among all the mellows, which do you consider best? Purport, Raghupati Upadhyaya replied, the mellow of conjugal love is supermost. 105. <laughs> Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu then said, You have certainly given first class conclusions. After saying this, he began to recite the full verse in a faltering voice. 106. Shemam meva param rupam puri maru puri bara bhaya kashora kam jayam. Adya eva paro rasa. The form of Sham Sundara is the supreme form. The city of Mathura is the supreme abode. Lord Krishna's fresh youth should always be meditated upon. And the mellow of conjugal love is the supreme mellow. This verse is found in the Padya Valley 82. 107. Prema Veshe Prabhu Tandre Kaila Alingana Prema Mataha Nateno Karena Nartana Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu then embraced Raghupati Upadhyaya in ecstatic love. Raghupati Upadhyaya also was overwhelmed by love and he began to dance. 108 Deki bala babata mane chamat kara haila 
Vi putra ani prabhura charane padila. Vallabha Bhattacharya was struck with wonder to see Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Raghupati Upadhyaya dance. Upadhyaya. Raghupati Upadhyaya dance. He even brought forward his two sons and made them fall down at the Lord's lotus feet. Purpur. The two sons of Vallabhacharya were Gopinath and Vitalesvara. When Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu visited Prayag in the year of 1434 or 1435 Sakabda era, A.D. 1412 or 1513, Vitalesvara was not yet born. In this regard, one should see Madhya Leela 18.47. One, uh, one hundred nine. Prabhu deki bade gramera sabalo kaila. Prabhu dara shane sabe. Krishna bhakta haila. Upon hearing that Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu had arrived, all the villagers went to see him. Simply by seeing him, they all became devotees of Krishna. One ten. Ramana Sakala Karena Prabhura Nimantrana Valhaba Bata Tanta Bare Karena Nivarana. All the Brahmanas of the village were eager to extend invitations to the Lord, but Valhaba Bhattacharya forbade them to do so. 111. Premo nama de pade goshani. Premon ma de pade goshani. Maja yamunate. Prayage chalai ba ihan. Nadi barahite. Vallabhabhata then decided not to keep Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu at Adaila because the Lord had jumped into the river Yamuna in ecstatic love. Therefore, he decided to bring him to Prayag. 112. Yanga icha prayagi yana karibe mantrana. Itabali prabulana karila gamana. Balbabhata said, If anyone likes, he can go to Prayag and extend, in, and extend invitations to the Lord. In this way, he took the Lord with him and departed for Prayag. 113. Ganga pate mahaprabhure no kate vasana prayage aila bata goshanire lana. Vallabhabhatacharya avoided the river Yamuna. Putting the Lord on a boat in the river Ganges, he went with him to Prayag. 114. Lokabida bhaye prabhu dasa bham medhe yana Nibhago shani re siksha karana shakti sancharya Due to the great crowds in Prayag, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu went to a place called Dasasva Medhagat. It was there that the Lord instructed Sri Rupa Goswami and empowered him in the philosophy of devotional service. Purport. Parasya Shaktir Vivedhaiva Shruyate. The Supreme Lord has multipotencies, which the Lord bestows on his fortunate devotees. The Lord has a special potency by which he spreads the Krishna consciousness movement. This is explained in the Chaitanya Charitamrita Antya Lila 7.11. Kali Kalera Dharma Krishna Nama Sankirtan. Kali Kale Dharma Krishna Nama Sankirtana Krishna Shakti Vina Nahe Tara Pravartana One cannot spread the holy name of Krishna without being specifically empowered by Lord Krishna. A devotee who receives his power from the Lord must be considered very fortunate. The Krishna consciousness movement is spreading to enlightened people about their real position. 
their original relationship with Krishna. One requires Krishna's special power in order to be able to do this. People forget their relationship with Krishna and work under the spell of Maya life after life, transmigrating from one body to another. This is the process of material existence. The Supreme Lord, Sri Krishna, personally descends to teach people about their or to teach people that their position in the material world is a mistaken one. The Lord again comes as Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu to induce people to take Krishna consciousness. The Lord also empowers a special devotee to teach people their constitutional position. 115. Krishna Tattva, Bhakti Tattva, Rasa Tattva, Pranta, Sabhase Kaila Prabhu, Bhagavata Siddhanta. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu taught Srila Rupa Goswami the ultimate limit of the truth about Lord Krishna, the truth about devotional service, and the truth about transcendental mellows, culminating in conjugal love between Radha and Krishna. Finally, he told Rupa Goswami about the ultimate conclusions of Srimad Bhagavatam. 116. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu taught Rupa Goswami all the conclusions he had heard from Ramananda Roy and duly empowered him so that he could understand them. Yeah. Thus ends our reading for today. All glories to Sri Pad Bhakti Madhava Pur Maharaj Ki Jai. All glories to Om Vishnu Pad Srila Paramahamsa. Om Vishnu Pad Paramahamsa Srila Satchirananda Bhakti Namalacharya Maharaj Ki Jai. Hare Krishna.